Right, okay. Uh, right, Cab Cap Video Diary. Today is um, Thursday, I think it's the 16th um, January 2020. Right, uh, been busy, um, sort of uh, uh, getting the Volkswagen kind of, um, well, just uh, doing some work on it really. Um, and uh, yeah, hopefully uh, we'll get that sold over the weekend, fingers crossed. Anyway, uh, that's out the way now, hopefully. Um, I've stuck it on Facebook. Uh, hoping that someone's going to come along and uh, maybe give me about 900 quid for it. There or thereabouts would be nice. Um, so we will see, we will see. Anyway, I'm off out to um, probably just the other side of uh, Ashbury near Lambourne. I was out there um, ooh, last week sometime. Going to try and do some more filming today. I've got my cameras, I've got this camera here. I've got my Lumix, I've got my GoPro 7. Uh, hero and um, got some food if I see some roadkill um, I'll stop and grab that as well <laughs> because I want to be filming um, want to be filming some uh, red kites if I can so slightly different approach this time um, I'm going to be setting the cameras up uh, further into the field and um, I'll be uh, coming back towards the wooded area and hiding and just letting the uh, cameras film and uh, I'll be out of the way with my Lumix perhaps zooming in on them but uh, quite well out of the way and uh, so they can't see me so uh, hopefully fingers crossed I think we should get uh, a better result this time than we did last time but anyway uh, we're going to give it a good go. Uh, we're going to give it a damn good go this time. <sighs> right, okay. Um, so we're in position once again. Um, I have my kind of my lure my equipment set up over there that's it over there somewhere I've got two cameras filming um, and I'm kind of hoping that it's going to uh, capture something for me today um, well whether it will or not I mean I don't honestly know but I'm quite well tucked away. There were some uh, some red kites flying about half a mile further up, more towards Ashdown House. I did stop there momentarily just to um, ponder. I think, well, you know, there's a few flying around here, so should I park up there rather than come down here? Um, I can see one over in the distance there. Whether it's going to make its way over here or not, I don't know, but. I've got my I've got my setup. It's it's all filming away now. I've got one camera, which is the uh, the GoPro Hero Seven, uh, which is on a stand. And I've got the uh, the GoPro Session Four, which is basically on the dirt, sort of pointing towards um, the food. So I've got a piece, a piece of chicken down there. I've also got a bit of bread. I know, I know they're not going to eat bread, you know, but it's more like, um, or there's something light or bright down there. I wonder what that could be, so they might come in for an investigation. That's my hope when they fly over, because they do fly quite low. Um, uh, so the tactic I used last week with it moving around it didn't quite work. I think they sussed that one out. Um, so I'm hoping this time, you know, I'm about 200 yards away from uh, from the cameras. I'm hoping that um, over time uh, they will come in and have a, a little look. Love to get one on cat on film, really, really close. I'd really love to, them to do that and see the meeting as well. Um, on the way up, I tried to find some roadkill. I did see a dead squirrel, but. Um, if, if it was a rabbit or something, you know, I would have stopped and uh, grabbed that and stuck it in a bag and then chucked it 
in the field but with a squirrel I've, I've, I've got a bit of a sentimental spot for squirrels <sighs> so I didn't bother in the end but um, an old rabbit might you know so a rabbit in there. Okay, right, um, video kind of continues. Uh, the weather is uh, increasingly getting worse, unfortunately. So I've taken shelter in the nearby wood of Ashdown Forest. I think what I'll do, I'm just gonna have a little walk around because I like the wood so much. We might see something, we might not. But um, yeah, let's, uh, let's go for a walk, shall we? Just getting a, uh, a slightly closer look um, at King Alfred's castle and the horses as well. Um, Wantage is, a, is around about, I don't know, about 10 miles away from here and that is the birthplace of King Alfred. Um, he lived to about 49 years of age, uh, did King Alfred, um, spent most of his time um, in the city of Winchester, which I believe was the old capital of England at that time when he was there. And King Alfred was uh, famous for being um, the King of the Wessex. In fact, I, th I think he was possibly the first king, the first king of England. Anyway, bit of history there for you. Some might enjoy that, some might not. But there you go. It's our history and our heritage and um, hey, you know, why should we forget that? I think it's very interesting.
Right, so I think I have basically come to um, the end of my video um, for today. Um, it hasn't really gone as planned. I would have liked to have got the red kite obviously on camera. Uh, it's very evident that that has not happened. It uh, doesn't mean to say that I'm not going to keep trying, I won't give up. Um, just a matter of time really. I don't know whether this is the a good time of year to go filming red kites. They are about, I guess they eat all year round, um, so I'll keep on coming out here from time to time and uh, do some filming because it is something which I enjoy and I think there's such wonderful beautiful birds. They are the biggest bird of prey we have in the UK, well around these parts anyway. Um, so it would be nice to get one on camera up and, and really really close. Um, so for the rest of the day I'm going to be um, going home, uh, doing some editing and um, yeah that's going to take me maybe a few hours to knock out some kind of a, a reasonable video. I'm just trying to capture the moment on camera then translate those moments onto my YouTube video to really give a nice experience you know for my viewer uh, that's really important it's something which I have a passion for I enjoy coming out here it's fresh air you know it's a bit wet it doesn't bother me it's a bit windy it doesn't bother me but I really enjoy my time out here I love my cameras I love taking the, the pictures I love taking the movies and the film taking it home stick it on an edit suite and that's when the magic really starts on the edit suite to come up with some kind of a watchable video so that you the viewer get something out of it you can at least feel and understand how I feel right now it's a wonderful place and I really really like it out here anyway just want to say um, thanks for watching okay uh, more videos to come um, that's a thumbs up so if you like the video give it a thumbs up if you didn't like it well you can thumb it down <laughs> there is that option I suppose uh, leave a comment I always try and answer all my comments um, as sincerely as I possibly can for some reason there are some comments which are not showing on my videos um, I've gone into the settings to try and um, alleviate that issue can't seem to do anything about it so if you do leave a comment but it doesn't show I have tried to reply to the comments can't seem to do it for some reason uh, but anyway thanks for commenting and um, yeah bye for now and I'll see you on next one take care